this simple favour making a huge difference. And there you have it, one bigly bag. Since the start of September, Ingrid Smith, owner of Ready Thready Sew, has encouraged local sewers to get involved in making wiggly bags for cancer patients. Wiggly bags are used by children that get cancer treatments. They're going to have a little Hickman line into the chest and it's um, 18 months that they have to have the little lines in and the lines are put into the wiggly bag so that they can play around. Central lines are used to administer chemotherapy, give medicines and take blood without the use of needles, with wiggly bags keeping the lines clean to prevent infection. Everybody wants to help because it is a good cause for, for the children and it, it seems to be like a community spirit, people want to be involved. This is Callie, who was diagnosed with a rare cancer of the liver at just two years old. Four years on and cancer-free, her mother Gemma felt at the time the Great North Children's Hospital were in need of more wiggly bags. When we went to the hospital, there's, there's not a great choice of bags. There's, there's some bags, but there's not a huge amount. She would choose different ones, um, depending on what she wanted to wear that day, <laughs> different ones to go with her outfit. And she's still got her wiggly bags now. They get um, a lion from one of the charities whose mane comes off when they lose their hair, but also has a central line. And she keeps one of her wiggly bags on, on this lion now. All the bags went to patients on the children's oncology ward, with hopes that this supply of bags will last until next summer. So it's a practical way of the children and being able to store their central line and still be able to play normally and that's what we aim for in hospital is normalised play so the less restrictions that the children feel the better for them. We have just delivered 1,400 wiggly bags to the cancer patients here at the Great North Children's Hospital. It's so lovely to see how grateful the nurses are for such a small donation.